So that said, some of you will find this a little awkward and don't worry about it. But I wanna see if you can take a big breath that you blow your whole belly out into a big balloon or a little balloon, whatever is shaped balloon. Inhale through the nose. Feel that belly get nice and round. Exhale, bring the belly in. And do that two more times. Inhale, feel your belly expand. Exhale, bring the belly back in. Good, and one more time. And exhale, bring the belly back in. Good. So we're gonna start to draw. This is a drawing meditation that I found on a search. I just typed in um, drawing meditation. <laughs> and this was the first one that came up. And I'm so thrilled because it's exactly what I was thinking of. And um, so you might wanna get your paper. Get your tape. You don't need a lot of tape, just enough tape to make sure that your, um, your paper is going to be stable and not move. So I'm taping the four corners. And voila. So this is just going to be for fun. This is not a product. This is going to just kind of show us our breathing. So choose, choose your, drawing, your drawing utensil. I'm choosing uh, a pen because the pen moves kind of smoother. And I'd love, I would love to invite you, we're gonna do this a few times to try a different utensil each time. And we're gonna stay with the same surface. So first time I'm gonna try a pen, probably the second time I'm gonna try a pencil. And I don't know, the third time, maybe I'll try a Sharpie. And you can do different colors. You can do whatever you want, or you could stay uh, in one color. Um, and then without gripping the pen, you're gonna hold the pen as you normally would. And we're gonna do this with open eyes. And you're just gonna have your eyes gently downcast at the paper. And you're gonna, you can start anywhere you want on the paper. So you could start in the middle, you could start at the bottom. And before we do anything, before you put pen to paper, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look for raised hands, but not just yet. Um, we're gonna have different directions. The first direction um, for one minute is gonna be just up and down. Can you see my action with my hand? I'm not actually making a mark, I'm pretending I'm drawing. Now you're gonna follow your breath. That breath that I just showed you, that long, deep breath, is bringing you into the parasympathetic nervous system. When you only breathe up here, that's the sympathetic nervous system. We need that. That's to run across the street so we don't get hit by a bus. But, <laughs> not that we're out trying to get a bus right now. But, um, but anyway, so we need that sympathetic nervous system. But right now, when we're when we're inside quarantining, we need to bring ourselves into the parasympathetic nervous system, which are the long, deep breaths with the emphasis on the exhale. So I'm gonna start, for me, I wanna start at the bottom of the paper. When I take my breath in, the mark is gonna go up. And when I take my breath out, the mark is gonna go down. And I make sure your pen works too. Okay, my pen works. So um, that's all we're gonna do. In breath, pen up, out breath, pen down. Another language, inhalation is pen up, exhalation, pen down. And we're not doing fast. We're doing the long, deep breaths that I showed. So for a brief moment, I'm gonna look. Is there anybody that has a question? Uh, if you know how to put a hand up with this Zoom function, or you can just give me jazz hands. Okay, nobody's jazz handing me and the people with their cameras off, I'm just assuming you're good too. So before we begin, does this sound like fun? Give me jazz hands and thumbs up. Great, fantastic. So, okay, here we go. Your pen, place it wherever you want. Have a gentle gaze at the paper. 
nice tall back. Remember, we don't want to shorten our muscles or round our spine. So we still want to have a nice lifted spine, shoulders relaxed. And we're just doing long, deep breaths. And I'm going to look at the time and begin. So inhale, the mark goes up. Exhale, mark goes down. And just keep going. And after your next exhale, just let the mark go wherever the mark goes and then put the pen down. And then let's switch, switch your device. So now I'm gonna to move to a pencil. And we'll do one another minute. So you're gonna take your pencil and remember you're not gripping it, it's a gentle grip. And it's like, let the drawing be a mirror of your breath. So it's not, you're not making a picture, you're just letting the drawing be a mirror of, the, of your breath. So you place, if you want this time, you can go side to side. So you can go up and down if you liked how that felt, or if you wanna try side to side. This is just an exercise. So are you ready? I'm gonna look at the clock. So just take a few deep breaths here. And begin. Follow your breathing pattern. There's no judgment. If you notice that you're feeling lightheaded or dizzy, let your breath go back to normal. Try to keep the pen or pencil on the paper. Try not to lift it up following the breath. On your next exhalation, you can stop. Okay, we're gonna move to the third, the third, So the first one for me, I went up and down. The second one, I went side to side. And the third one, I'm just gonna let it go around. Just a circular movement. But this time I'm gonna invite you, if those two felt safe, to close your eyes. And you're just gonna follow your breath with your eyes closed. And remember, if at some point this doesn't feel comfortable because we're you're taking in more oxygen when you breathe this way. So you could have some sensations of lightheadedness. And actually that's, if it's a good lightheadedness, it's a good thing because you're, get, you're bringing seven times more oxygen to your body, they say in yoga, that's what they say. When you do these, this breathing pattern, it's called Dirga Swasan, three-part breath. If you prefer to go up and down and side to side, and that's my cat you're gonna hear crying because she always cries when I teach, sorry. <laughs> um, or you could do a circle. And remember, this is not a product. This is just a, a game to open you up, literally the breath, the body, the mind, and now the paper. So I'm gonna look at the clock and let's just give it a moment. So let's take some, a moment. You can make a sound like this, go. To let some tension go. Let's do another one. Inhale. Great. And one more time. Inhale. Great. 
and then you can bring the pen somewhere if you're going to go up and down or side to side. I'm going with circles. So I'm bringing my hand to the paper and begin. So in breath and the out breath is long. I'm not lifting my pen or pencil, whatever you have off the paper. It's continually touching the paper. You can have your eyes open or your eyes closed. I'm keeping mine open to know the time so that you can feel safe so that you're not going past the time. And breath. Long. 